Welcome back to the Grim Workshop. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Mark Merriweather Signature Card. Mark Verderbruggen, better known as Merriweather, is a foraging and plant expert. He actually has a PhD in organic chemistry. I've got his foraging book right here. You can find out more about what he does on his website, Foraging Texas. This is not a survival card. This card aids in foraging, and that's really unique. This is all one tool, so nothing's really going to come off of here. So in this case, it's still sized, just like all the other signature cards. So this is going to slip right into an Altoid Survival 10 or into the credit card slot of your wallet. But there's no backer. There's no adhesive to this. This is just one solid tool that is going to help you out in the field. This is a purpose-built card. You don't have fishing hooks and sewing needles on here. This deals with one thing, one task, and that's going to be harvesting wild edibles. But there's a lot of really unique tools in here. This is going to pair perfectly with your favorite survival card that you're already carrying. So right here on top, you've got a set of tweezers. And that can help you pull thorns off plants, but most of the time it's probably going to help you pull a thorn out of your own skin. Right on top here, you see we've got this half moon cut, and that's a scraper. So this is going to help us get to the inner portions of the plant. So staying on the top of the card, right here you can see I've got a sharpened section of the card, and that's our blade. So that's going to help you cut up plants. So you can choke up on this, a couple different ways you can hold this. But that's going to help you cut sections of plants out. Definitely always handy to have a cutting tool with you. Now if we come down to this V section, this is a tick removal tool. Now that is something I am always happy to have with me. And the fact that it's integrated right into this card, nothing extra to carry, nothing to lose, that is perfect. So coming off of our tick tool, we've got this offset V. And this is actually a mushroom knife. So this is going to let me go right over the stalk of a mushroom and make a nice low cut. Now the bottom side is a straight edge to it. And the top's got really tiny serrations. So that's going to help just saw through some of, uh, some of the bigger funguses. I've got a couple tools down here on the bottom. So this is a saw. And that's going to help you harvest kind of woodier plants. So like a dog bane or milkweed is not something that you're really able to pull through. And that's going to do a great job cutting through there. Above that saw, you can see here I have a ruler. And that's going to help you ID the plant. As you're referencing most field guides, the size of the leaf and the size of the plant is usually a key indicator on what it is. So that is very helpful to have with you. So this comb edge here, this is actually a berry picker. So I've seen these for use in a garden or for more commercial use, but this thing will fit right in your wallet. So that is pretty cool. We'll take a walk in the woods and see if I can find any berries to pick with this. But essentially you're just dragging them off and you're leaving the branches and the stems and you're just peeling off the berries. So now you see I've got multiple size holes and those are leaf strippers. So to do that, you've got a lot of different options. I've set some golden lead here. And we're just going to find the appropriate size. And I'm going to start it through here. And look at this. Do I need a leaf stripper? Not all the time. You can do that by hand. But again, this takes up no space in your kit. This is ultra lightweight. It's multifunctional. So with this kind of use, you know, if wild edibles are not your thing, well, what better reason to get out there? Go ahead and get Mark's manual, get one of these uh, signature survival cards, and then head out there and start learning more plants.